Johnston County's loss could be the East's gain. CSX planned to build a cargo hub south of Raleigh in Johnston County. It was scratched, though, after landowners opposed the prospect of being forced to sell their property. Instead, that facility will now be built in Edgecombe County. Closer look at why so many Eastern North Carolina people are excited about that project in this Growing the East special report. The railroad is a huge part of the history of Rocky Mount. These tracks run through the heart of downtown. But the impact trains had on the economy diminished over time here and all across eastern North Carolina. That could soon change. This is an artist rendering of the new CSX Carolina Connector. It's scheduled to be built here on this empty land just a few miles north of Rocky Mount. News of the facility is encouraging to many, including the Edgecombe County town of Princeville, still recovering after Hurricane Matthew. Bringing jobs to the area or just to Edgecombe County would be a great impact to us. Uh, it would also help rebuild our community. They're excited in urban areas like Greenville. This is as big as an economic engine as a potential military plant would be in a region of the state. And even in rural parts of the east like Martin County. I hate to use the word game changer, but this will be the most significant event that we've had since the four laning of 64. And that's an awfully big statement. The $270 million facility will be located on about 500 acres of land east of Highway 301 in Edgecombe County. Only the second terminal of its kind in the CSX network. It's expected to bring 300 high paying jobs. This facility will be a hub for CSX's intermodal network in the south, just like our terminal in North Baltimore, Ohio is in the north. So for freight containers will be transferred in on trucks and trains. They'll be transferred to other trucks and trains by wide span electric cranes that are nearly silent and then ships for outbound delivery to their final destination. That's good for the immediate area near the terminal. What's even more exciting is that the project could eventually create 13,000 related jobs statewide with many of them likely to reside in eastern North Carolina. If you are within 75 miles then that gives you a distinct advantage in terms of cost. And so the long-term opportunities for us in Martin County in terms of job growth are, are tremendous. Definitely a reason to be excited, even more so when you hear the names of companies who located close to other similar CSX facilities. For example, in Winter Haven, Florida, in the surrounding areas, we've seen Amazon, um, Walmart, other super centers come close to that area who use the terminal. And because of that, optimism is running high all across eastern North Carolina from Edgecombe County. Hopefully this will turn into a hub of, uh, of opportunities for um, economic development. To the east's largest city. If you're a citizen in Green, Greenville or in Pitt County, this will mean jobs for you and also for your family for decades going forward. And even down that four-lane U.S. Highway 64 in Martin County. This puts a bullseye right on eastern North Carolina. And this gives us a tremendous opportunity and for the next 10 years to really take advantage of that. We're very fortunate to have such great partners at the state and local level, and we're committed to developing a terminal that Rocky Mount and the state of North Carolina can be proud of. Another potential benefit, CSX predicts 270,000 fewer trucks will be traveling across North Carolina once that terminal opens. Now, right now, the crews are doing assessments and surveying the boundaries of the site. Construction is set to begin towards the end of 2018 with the facility up and running by the end of 2019.